How's it going everyone and welcome to another upgrades video as in my last video our theory stands correct. We know which players will potentially reach a certain rating. Now this was supposed to be a video explaining the La Liga, Bundesliga and League One upgrades and potential investments but due to my busy work schedule I will tonight just provide the League One upgrades and investments as they should be live tomorrow. Make sure to subscribe and be notified when I drop my La Liga plus Bundesliga video. Before we start with the upgrades and potential investments, I would like to thank every one of you for trusting my theory and sending me all the love in the past few days. The player cards that were believed to get an upgrade by a wider range of people went down in price. That's why I always suggested to either sell in the hype, which usually happens in the first minutes into the upgrades, or sell a few moments before that. The players who weren't that predictable went up in price loads and you could have made good profit on them. If we jump right into the League 1 upgrades, you guys already know that Cavani will get his upgrade. His goal card will go from an 85 to an 86 rated card, which will force all of his informs to get a plus 1 rating. As I mentioned earlier, Cavani is a player believed to get an upgrade by a wider range of people. His price is already inflated by 60k and I wouldn't advise you on buying this card. Another player that already inflated a few thousand coins is Buda Boos. His card will get a plus 1 upgrade, which means his informs will go up in rating by plus 1 as well. However, we don't know if this card will get much demand as even if upgraded, EA might keep its stats pretty low. Another upgrade is Glick. His price is still around the same value as he was on PS4, but on Xbox he has risen quite a few K. I'm unsure on Glick at this moment, but there is potential in making some profit on this card if you're on a PS4 console. Another pretty obvious upgrade is Balotelli, who has already inflated and wouldn't recommend you guys buying him at this moment. Dante is also believed to get an upgrade, but the stats boost that we predict on this card shouldn't make him go up in value by a lot. Another upgrade candidate is Lamar, which is already inflated as well. Potentially there could be some coins made on this card if you manage to sell it in the hype. There are a few players who are getting upgraded to a 79 rating but we're still unsure if EA will boost their informs as well, as in the game some of these 79 rated players have 82 rated informs, others have 83. However, they boosted some special card in the BPL upgrade so they could do the same with Braidwick. Gomez is another card that could potentially jump to an 83. Keep in mind that his November card will be affected. Ricardo Pereira also gets a 79 rated card which will boost his inform by 1. Bernardo Silva's inform won't get upgraded, so if you hold any of his cards, make sure to sell them before the upgrades come as his informs have inflated in the past few days. Valbuena is also not getting an upgrade on his inform card, as 80 rated cards get 83 rated informs, therefore he would need an A1 rated card upgrade to get a plus 1 on his inform card. Same applies to Falcao as he will get an 82 rated card, his informs should stay at the same value. I have left this card for last as this is in my opinion the best possible investment you guys can make. Dovan is predicted to get an 81 rated upgrade which would make his 82 rated inform go to an 84 rated card. If EA do upgrade his inform this will be possibly the best cheapest beast French inform on a position that doesn't give much competition. Keep in mind that not all players who were predicted to be upgraded got in the list in the Calcio and BPL leagues so this investment is at your own risk. However, I got Tovan under 15k on PS4 and hope to make some profit on him tomorrow. Thank you guys for watching. If I forgot to mention anyone, please provide some feedback and make sure to subscribe on your way out.